About a month ago, I did a video on a project called Tokenfy, symbol T-O-K-E-N. It's a project that was launched by the team of Floki, one of the largest meme coins in the world. And this project has done extremely well since it first launched. We talked about it before it launched. We've talked about a number of major updates. In today's video, I want to go over one of the biggest announcements to date for Tokenfy, and that is that Tokenfy's token launcher is officially live and on mainnet. It's mainnet on five top EVM blockchains, Ethereum, BNB chain, Base, Arbitrum, and OP BNB. So with TokenFi Launcher, anyone can go about creating a fungible token, whether that's ERC-20, um, ERC-721, a multi-token, really multiple types of tokens with a few simple clicks. And you can see it in the video right here. The cool thing about it is that it's powered by the native ecosystem token uh, of TokenFi, symbol T T O K E N. That's the main utility token and every successful transaction on the Ethereum and BNB blockchain buys and burns T O K E N tokens. So that's why we've seen TokenFi's token continue to increase in value since it launched when it launched at, at very, very low prices compared to where it is now. You can see it's up significantly from where it first launched and even just in the last 14 days alone, it's up another almost 30%. So you can see that the price has increased and been able to hold that level since it launched just um, a few months ago. We talked about this project first off in about October of 2023. So with TokenFi, there's a few main things I do want to go over. So basics, if you didn't see the other video on TokenFi, um, the main thing to know about TokenFi is that it is an all-in-one tokenization platform for creating and tokenizing uh, assets in just a few simple clicks. That is why their recent announcement of the launcher being such a big deal. That's officially on mainnet on the top five um, EVM blockchains. Like I said, Ethereum, BNB chain, Base, Arbitrum, and OP, BNB. So this is a really, really big deal because it ultimately is trying to attack and combat the, the potential $16 trillion tokenization industry, which is expected to be at $16 trillion by 2030. If you look at it, there are a few major things um, and people who have been projecting tokenization to become a main uh, stream thing in the financial space. So we could see that first of all, there was a major article talking about the forecast of tokenization. It says that $16 trillion, that's the forecast value of real world assets expected to be tokenized by 2030. You can also see that major financial institutions like uh, the CEO of JP Morgan and Chase, Jamie Dimon, he came out in a recent interview on CNBC and he said that... He's bullish on utility-focused cryptocurrency and has emphasized its value in technologies such as the tokenization of real-world assets and data movement. Not only has the CEO of JP Morgan and Chase said about tokenization, said how he's bullish on it long-term, but we've also seen another major financial institution, um, BlackRock. Larry Fink, the CEO of BlackRock, said that he sees tokenization as the next step forward after Bitcoin ETFs and everything that we've been seeing with Bitcoin ETFs. BlackRock uh, manages over $10 trillion in assets, the largest financial institution in the world. And him talking about um, tokenization being a major, major uh, stay in the financial space is something that is extremely bullish as well because TokenFi is combating and specifically addressing this exact sector of the market with tokenization. So when you're looking at the white paper for TokenFi, there's a few main things that stand out. First of all, like I said, you can see the about TokenFi section where it talks about some of the basics of the platform, um, talks a little bit about BlackRock, and how they have talked about uh, tokenization being the next evolution of markets. It talks about how the Floki core team is the one who launched TokenFi, how uh, Floki has uh, 460,000 holders. They have a brand recognized by over 3 billion people. They had an all-time high brand valuation of $3.5 billion. And the team behind TokenFi is the same as the team behind Floki, which achieved all of these massive values. And remember, Floki at the initial stages of Floki was a meme coin. They've built an entire ecosystem around this, but TokenFi is actually attacking a major, major problem and major 
um, obstacle in the financial space. And that's why we've seen, you know, BlackRock and, and JP Morgan Chase and all these companies talk about it. So this project, I think, has even more potential than Floki ever did. So you can see that they have a list of the TokenFi products. You can see that it stands out. So they have the TokenFi Token Launcher, TokenFi Launchpad, TokenFi AR Smart Contract Audit, Auditor, uh, the TokenFi RWA Tokenization Module, the Quick Bot, uh, the Quick Launch Bot, the Journey of AI, Connect, and TokenFi Staking. So if we click on the launcher, you can see how they talk about how to go about launching a token. Actually, in one of our last videos, we went through the entire process. So I'll make sure to link that down below. But it's very simple to go about launching your own token. We went over specifically how to do this with the Quick Bot, uh, the, the Quick Launch Bot, and I'll link that video down below. But again, this one is extremely simple. You can go about launching your own token directly through Telegram or Discord in just a few clicks. It walks you through the entire process and it shows you a little graphic of it right here. But again, we did this in one of our last videos. So if you want a step-by-step -step guide, make sure to check that out. I'll link those down below. Also, they talk about the launch pad. Uh, this launch pad is going to enable users to raise funds for their tokens in a decentralized manner. And um, TokenFi Launchpad will also integrate Floki's crypto locker protocol, FlokiFi Locker, making it a key component on of the platform in a way that enhances the security of tokens promoted through the platform. And you can see all these other uh, products as well, one of which is staking. Uh, also, I do have some TokenFi tokens um, that we've gone about staking. We went through this again in the last video. So if you want to generate some additional passive income, you can go ahead and check out TokenFi staking as well. All of this is just directly through their website. You could see by Floki, by TokenFi, you could click on staking. It'll bring you just directly to to the screen where you go ahead and stake and earn rewards as well. Moving forward on the white paper, there's a few other things. So that's going to be with security and audit. One of the important things with the white paper in the security and audit section is that the TokenFi platform recently had a major announcement from Certic. And with this, if you go ahead and look at a recent Twitter post from Certic, um, you can see that TokenFi has advanced to the 237th position out of more than 11,500 projects um, highlighted on the Certic security security leaderboard. Recently, TokenFi has increased its security score because they've incorporated some of uh, Certix feedback as well as uh, several key products that have recently launched. And at this time, we're just close to launching. So we had seen that go up even more, which is something that is really good if you're an investor because you like to see that security score continue to get higher and higher. One thing about Certix, something that is important to note is that it's one of the leading security focused ranking platforms in the crypto space. If you're ever investing in a new project, you usually look at Certic and seeing that uh, TokenFi has continued to increase its score, that's something that you really want to see for a project because they address feedback. They're actively trying to make the project better and they're taking this into account. So this is something that I really do like to see with um, TokenFi. You can even go ahead and look at it just directly on Certix website as well, you could see that it does say that they have a score of uh, AA, so it's over 86.51, and category score of 91.78 in the top 10%. Um, this is all exactly what you want to see. Now let's talk a little bit about the next thing on their white paper, which is going to be with partners. In terms of partners, they have a lot of major, major names from CoinGecko to Coin Liquidity Solutions to Dex Tools, Yellow Cap. Capital, DWF Labs, and Caron Labs. All these are major partners in the crypto um, and technology investment space. So it's good to have these as well. When you're looking at the token launcher guide and the quick bot launch guide, again, these just go by step by step how to go about launching your token. Again, it is extremely, extremely simple. You can just connect your wallet, choose the type of token you want to create, which it gives you, you know, three different options to choose from a crypto token, NFT project, and ERC 1155 multi-token. Then you go ahead and provide basic info, name, uh, decimal places, symbol, token supply, all of that. You can use another feature where you can have uh, in terms of tokenomics for transaction fees, burn fees, reflections, buyback liquidity. Five, step five is going to be ultimately setting transaction fees if you want any. And then really at the end, all you need to do is confirm the transaction. So it's an extremely simple, easy, intuitive process, not only for the token launcher guide, but also on the quick launch bot. It's the same for both Discord and for Telegram. 
It's just a step-by-step guide that brings you through in just a few quick steps. Um, you can go about launching a token. So it could be directly on their token launcher or just on their quick launch bot, either on Telegram or on Discord. Last thing I do want to go over with this is going to be their user incentives system. So with the user incentive system, they recently launched this to help to accelerate uh, accelerate the platform adoption. So TokenFi is leveraging this referral system to ultimately help grow the platform. So um, the way it works is of particular interest is the TokenFi user incentive system. 5% of the total TokenFi supply is allocated to user incentives, which is something that is really unheard of, having that much of the supply allocated to user incentives. And you can see that with the user incentive system, it's going to reward the following categories of users. Users who create a token with TokenFi Token Launcher or quick bot, uh, or the Quick Launch Bot. That's something that simple. If you go about using the actual platform, then you are eligible for their user incentive system. Users who raise funds through the TokenFi Launchpad. Users who use the to- TokenFi AI Contract Auditor. Users who connect with MMs, exchanges, institutions, and thought leaders through TokenFi Connect. And there's a few other things, but really, it's if you interact with the system, you go about using the entire uh, TokenFi ecosystem, you can then receive um, part of that 5% of the total token five supply which has been allocated to user incentives so ultimately that is something that is going to be very very valuable long term if you're interacting with the ecosystem last few things i do want to go over with the project are going to be when you look at some of their aspects in terms of marketing and leadership because this is something that's really important like i said earlier uh, the token five team is led by the same team from floki and you can see the actual uh, directors and people behind the project over on X. You can see that Saber is the advisor and creative marketing director for both Floki, which has, you know, hundreds of thousands of followers and TokenFi. That's something that's really cool because seeing that they have the same marketing behind them, but this time TokenFi, in my opinion, has even more utility is something that is extremely, extremely exciting. In addition to this, you can see that um, Saber and TokenFi will be launching a new marketing campaign that we've already started to see a lot of previews of. So you could go ha- about and see one of the uh, new videos that just came out on um, Floki's website just a couple of hours ago. They launched this over on X and they also announced this across all social media platforms. This is Valhalla official trailer number one. You can see the graphics of this are absolutely insane, something that we have haven't yet seen in the crypto space, in my opinion, and that makes me really excited for the project long term because this is a is an aspect, a very strong aspect of the Floki ecosystem and TokenFi ecosystem, where it's going to help create a ton of value for the project. And you can see these graphics; it is unlike anything I've seen in the crypto space to date. Really, they look like triple A rated graphics. Some of the best quality graphics it looks like very cool gameplay. This is something that just looks really, really unique to me 